Hi, Dave Snyder here. It is uh, the 21st day of November 2013. In my last video, I uh, was showing the Jackson crater on the moon reversed over the Earth right here. And I I had it li uh, centered right here, in this spot right here. But then I decided to type in the name Jackson uh, as I was with, with my... Uh, my cursor placed basically in this area. I just typed typed in Jackson up here and, and brought up the closest Jacksons to the area, and Jackson, Mississippi, Jackson, Tennessee, and it was pretty close. So I I actually moved it down to here, and let's take a look at that. I'm not sure if it goes right there. It, it could still go right there. They just are calling this Jackson. It, they they named it after Andrew Jackson or whatever. So they say. But if but it's kind of odd, you know that uh, Jackson, the Jackson crater just fits perfectly there. No no question about that. It's guaranteed, guaranteed. If not right here, then up right up here where I had it the first time. It's kind of kind of oh, excuse me, kind of interesting how they call these uh call that Jackson right in the center of that impact. Name it after say it's named after whoever you want, but I. <laughs> I mean, this crater's probably named after Andrew Jackson, you know? So, anyways. Probably because they, when they finally got up to, satellites up to the moon, they were seeing that crater. They found out that it hit that area that was already called Jackson in the United States, and they just named the crater Jackson. How about that? Makes sense to me. I mean, they, they didn't know this side, see this side of the moon until after they got satellites into space, so... You know, that had obviously been named uh, Jackson for some time, so that's probably why they called this crater Jackson, because it hit this area of the Earth where, the, where Jackson is. Named after Andrew Jackson, I, I imagine. Okay? That's it. Just a little update. Have a good day.